Hi, I'm Libby, and I'm the Design Director with PSA Essentials, and I'm here to talk about peel and stick stamps. Usually, self-inking stamp designs are glued directly onto the stamp. So, if you want a new design, you have to buy an entirely new stamp. Not the case with PSA peel and stick. With these, you simply peel away the design and stick on a new one. You can change your designs thousands of times, all with one stamper, including personalized. And it's so easy to use. Anybody can do it. Let's start with my personalized monogram stamp. You'll see it's ready to go just as soon as you get it. Simply press down and that's it. Now, I love my monogram, but it doesn't always fit my mood or suit my occasion. So the great thing about peel and stick, I can change the designs so easily. All I need is a dry paper towel, a new peel and stick pack, and of course my stamper. And for this one, since I want the design perfectly centered, I'm gonna use my alignment tool. I'm selecting the cupcake. It's one of my favorites. I use it all the time to sweeten up projects for my daughter. So I'll place the design smooth side up in the center so the notches line up. Now I'm gonna take my stamper, compress, and lock it with the red buttons. Now I'm just gonna take my dry paper towel, wipe away the ink, that's just so I don't get it on my fingers, and I'm ready to peel it off. You'll see it comes right off and I can just stick it right back here on my pack. One of the great things about this technology is the dies never lose their stickiness, so you can stick them over and over again. It's pretty cool, right? All right, now I'm ready to take my stamper, put it over my alignment tool, and press down firmly. That's it, the die is set, and I'm ready to stamp. And check that out, my design is perfectly centered. Super easy, right? Even easier, if you don't need the design perfectly centered, is changing the design without the alignment tool. Check this out. See this seam? It runs right down the center. All you're gonna do is take the design, find the notch, and match it up with the seam. That's it. Now I can stamp. Check that out. Now, you don't have to use peel and stick stamps with the PSA Stamper. If you're like me and you have a ton of acrylic blocks at home, this is just another way to use it. All you're gonna do is select your design and place it here on the block. It really works just like any other clear stamp. Gonna take your ink, ink it up, and I'm gonna press down like this. See, so, so versatile. Use it with the stamper or the block. For stamps, inks, and shops, visit psaessentials.com. Also, check out my blog at psastampcamp.blogspot.com. I'm Libby O. See you next time.